Hi, I'm Sudi Pong from EDA International. Today I'm going to show you how to log in OVC data into MS SQL Server. My database name is Test and the table name is P3. I have uh, six columns ID, time date, V1, V2, V3, and V4. Let's get started by Open Vision Studio Express and create new project. I use Vision Basic and Video Form application. Name your project, for example, CLVC DB Log. Now insert CLVC 32 into the form and then specify the OPC server. and OPC tag. In this example, I will insert uh, four value of OPC tags into V1, V2, V3, and V4. Four column and the timestamp into time date. Now get back to OBC, sorry, to the OBC property. Specify 1000 update rate. This means 1000 milliseconds or one second. Then click OK. Put timer into the form. Specify the interval. In this example, I use 5000 milliseconds. This is the interval of DB locking. Make sure that you have uh, specified the enable property to fails. Then we connect to the OPC server at the form load by click on the form and select event. Then we click on load event and write the code. Connect to the OPC server. And then enable timer. We enable timer after connecting to OPC server. We need to disconnect from the OPC server as well at forum crossing. Then go to form crossing event. and disconnect from the OPC server. Now go to timer. Open the web link uh, under the video description. This is the example code to logging OPC data into Microsoft SQL Server. Copy the code. And then go to Vision Studio, paste the code. You need to import the library of SQL client. Take a look at the code. As you can see, we're connecting to table 3, but the actual actual name of our table is P3. Then we have to specify this name. Okay. And then uh, check the column name is exactly uh, to the real column that you have. So we have uh, four columns, then I need to add more parameters. 
into this curing. At this code, we get the value of the OPC tag into the parameter, parameter 1 to parameter 4. If you cannot remember, get back to the form and right click on the COPC property. Then, just you can see, there are index number of the OPC tags, 0 to 3. Get VL0 will keep the data of the first OPC tag into the parameter 1 and so on. You have to specify the SQL server name, username, password, and database name. For the SQL server name, take a look at the Management Studio Express. This is the name of uh, my server. Then I have to specify, I have to correct it. And it is, this is the uh, username and password. and the database name okay now save it and testing for five seconds the value will be inserted into the SQL table now take a look at the SQL table Order by okay. GESC and then execute. Sorry. Okay. The value have inserted successfully. Re execute again. Just you can see the ID number added. Okay, thank you for watching.